Hello everybody, I hope that you are doing very well and welcome back to another cryptocurrency technical analysis where in today's video I'm going to be going through how I am currently trading Bitcoin, where my targets are for Bitcoin and the support that we are actually bouncing off right now. Uh, having said that, I probably should be taking profit, but here we are with the video, so <laughs> let's just go into this. Um, so, I mean, firstly, we just have to appreciate how technically technically perfect this this trading range has been that we are in okay uh and this all started obviously from the rise on the 18th of december uh you know for over 15 percent rise so very impulsive rise from the lows okay that was obviously a swing failure pattern from that swing failure pattern we obviously had our a b c d e triangle okay so a very very perfect triangle that broke to the upside okay as one would expect okay from that upside rise we obviously had our downwards move to take some low of low of the liquidity um and then you know looking for that search back to the upside and as we were moving back up here i was also entering short positions because i was expecting us to reject from the weekly before moving back down again okay and if you know interested this was all documented in my uh you know throughout the group that I do every single day and also in the last champion stream where I was uh, you know talking about this short people entering this short with me well ended up very nice indeed my stop loss by the way which is you know pretty amazing the stop loss on this short by the way was 7526 okay the high was 7524 so within two dollars of the high just you know that's when you have knowledge of good stop loss placements that's what they should be doing so for within two dollars of that high you know ask any any champion in the group they can back this up absolutely um and yeah from that high we obviously traded it down to the lows have a guess where we got bottomed out yesterday okay from the low to the high we obviously had the 618 we got an initial bounce off of the 618 okay and this is where Again, it gets it gets very much like I have a crystal ball. But I was expecting one more, you know, liquidity grab of the lows. So we obviously had the initial bounce, 6,900. I was expecting one more move down, but then actually do get in a bounce in this CC. And uh, my entry in the end was 6,888. Okay, we obviously now sit at, six, well, I, I closed out around six, 7,300. So it's about a 6% gain overnight while sleeping. So not bad at all. Um... <laughs> never counter trade the uh the uh the magnets by the way They're, they just work perfectly uh but yeah that obviously leads us to uh you know from shorting at the weekly level to longing down in the cc to you know closing my long at the top and i have now just entered a short position okay and this is a bit of a, a funny one that uh, a few days ago this was wednesday i l sometimes lose track of days so we're on friday now aren't we so friday uh, two days ago at Wednesday, I was saying I was waiting for this 7,380 level. And then we had a little bit of a joke in the group of people are going to front run me. So I have to front run then because uh, whenever I post something in the, in the group, it generally gets front run. Uh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, we had this little bit of a, a, a joke, let's say, of 7,380. And I also backed it up this morning of saying, you know, possibly this was well priced, by the way, was at 7,280. I was saying possibly one more push to this 7,380 region, but I do not foresee it getting above 7,420 today. OK, and as we can see here, uh, let's come down to a lower term time frame. Just how lovely, lovely, lovely this is. OK, from the lows to the highs, we topped out in the end at 7,377. OK, so I was actually shorting this primarily on my main account, by the way, but I was getting in my shorts at 7,375. OK. Uh, so yeah, literally two dollars within the top, and we have seen a drop down now. Okay, so where has this drop occurred? Okay, trend line, trend line, third trend line, and also just being the fact low to high, you know, six one eight. This this six one eight number just coming in all the time. Uh, so yeah, this should be where you're taking profit. So I'm going to show you some of the trades that I'm in right now. So this is obviously the challenge account. Amazing, by the way. Yes, I have now hit uh, five Bitcoin on this challenge account. I made a post about this. Yeah. I've been doing this since June and I've started at one Bitcoin, just hit five, six months, 500% gain. Yeah, pretty amazing if I must say so myself. But this is like this. This is how you do it. OK, this is just consistently how you're doing it. And so I have actually compounded this one because this was not the original entry, as you can see here. This has actually had some, you know, uh, yeah, more entries added to it, by the way. <laughs> but nevertheless, shorting around this 6,000, yeah, 7,000. Uh, 7,350 region. Okay, I have added some more compounds down at the lows, but really what I'm going to do after I finish this video is actually take profit on this uh, and then see, okay, in the short term, I just wanted to load this up to show you that I am actually in a position and safely in profits on this one. Okay, just for a bit of transparency. But uh, what the, what I'm looking for now is ideally, 
one will move to the upsides and then following to the downside okay so this trend line is very very key okay so it's not a new position generally that you'd be looking to take but you could look like this okay this is a very very key support so in the short term we have really 7230 support okay so 7230 support and we're looking at resistance really you know 7300 is resistance again okay uh, but if you are in a short then this as I'm going to be saying to my group in a second this is definitely a take profit region okay you should really be locking in about 30% profits and you know moving your stop loss down to entry or you know high of those wicks um but you know you've got to be taking some profits at this at this region because it is support okay one you know you could essentially see something like this okay you could see that so you know with that being a possibility you know it doesn't harm to pay yourself lock in some profits and you know move on to another you know and the next trade that presents itself okay um so all, all very nice on bitcoin and i am also trading altcoins right now uh so yeah i just got in on that uh walton chain move that was a uh, nice 10 percent move right there uh also mana this is uh, around seven percent and also basic attention token about two percent um but yeah these have been also technically it's really technically trading well. I'll, I will show you all Walton Chain because this is just really simple. I can show you this in a second. Walton Chain, simply we had the 1618 extension. Okay, so the 1618 extension from that, that's, you know, look, up about 10%. So that was my entries down at these lows. And, uh, you know, that's a 10% gain. So it's, and, and again, this is the challenge account that I hold for Binance. So again, I update my group with the trades that I'm taking on these challenge accounts. Um, so I got a challenge account on Binance and a challenge account, obviously, on BitMEX itself. So I trade a bit of alts. You can see I'm also in Cardano on this one, uh, which is also in some pretty nice profits. Um, but yeah, well, they're not that great, I guess. But nevertheless, profits are profit. But um, yeah, you know, so if you're interested in seeing how I trade Bitcoin or altcoins, then, you know, the group is open. Uh, and I just want, you know, I'm, I am absolutely, absolutely more than comfortable shitting my group because I've absolutely killed this market like not to blow my own horn you can read some of the comments in the group but yeah absolutely have have killed this market uh so more than comfortable saying that i'm very good at this right now uh, um so yeah I think that's everything that I wanted to lay out for you. I've laid out the important support levels, okay? And that, that's what we are on right now. So this definitely is a take profit region, okay? So this is a take profit. Um, and this is the important support, seven, you know, 7,230. If, if we do something like this, so the two scenarios that I'll try and get out here are either that we hold this, we do manage to probably get a bounce off 7,300 and then move back up again, okay? So this is going to be a really, really, really key region. Okay, 7,300 again uh, to 7,320. Okay, if we do this, okay, drop down and move up, then yeah, we're, we're obviously going to be focusing higher levels. This video is meant for the short term, by the way. If we do anything like this, though, drop down, lose this trend line, then lose 7,230, we're probably going to be looking back down to around the seven, you know, 7,150, 7,000 region again. So this is a really, really pivotal moment and i hope that you appreciate me taking the time to make this video for you today um two o'clock on a on a friday <laughs> uh so yeah this was just a quick update for how i am trading bitcoin right now what i am now looking at uh in in probably the coming hours okay i, I am foreseeing a little bit of a rise here where i'm going to continue to uh, compound my short myself you know I'm comfortable doing this, so I will try and get in another. Well, this I'm referring to the challenge account. I'll try and get another forty grand off of that, and uh, yeah, move then hopefully see the move back down. But obviously the the red sign, okay. So the red sign, I am going to lock in profits by the way here, and the red sign for me is if we do this and get back above, you know, seven three twenty really, okay, seven three twenty, seven three thirty. I'll say if we get above that, then it's very likely that we can go back up higher and challenge some highs, okay. Uh, but yeah more absolutely more than content with how i've traded this short long and up again in the shorts and pfft, yeah absolutely perfection if i'm not if i must say so myself not to blow my ho own horn anymore <laughs> because my ego is probably exploding right now i hope that you have thoroughly enjoyed this video <laughs> i really 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 need to manage that because i know it's very ugly when i do things like this and i apologize greatly but yeah, I'm very happy, as you can probably imagine. Um, <laughs> uh, so uh, if you have enjoyed this video and it's given you some insights to how I'm trading this, um, then, you know, I would thoroughly appreciate a like, you know, down below. That would be absolutely great. And, um, you know, I'll catch you in the next video, I guess. Well done to the guys on Twitter as well that follow me. Uh, this guy, Long6933. So that was a, you know, you know that's about a 6 7% rise overnight as well. So well done, my friends. Uh, and people in the group, well, yeah profits are 
rolling. Uh, <laughs> hope that you've thoroughly enjoyed this one. I will catch you in the next video. Hope that you have had a brilliant, I, I need to end with this. Hope you had a brilliant new year and 2020 is going to be great. Year of the trader. Absolutely. Uh, thank you very much. Cheers and goodbye.